友達だから特別よ菊池くん本当は私がモデルをやるのはいろんな人に話を通さないといけないんだから What's going on, YouTube? My name is Vitamin D. And welcome back to some King Koi Golden Love Ridge. This is episode 22. If you've not seen episode 21, go ahead and watch it. I'll wait. Also, there's no also, but if you do happen to enjoy this video, please hit that like. Please. And if you haven't subscribed, do that right now. Like, right, right now. Do it. <laughs> Anyways, without further ado, let's get straight into this video. I'm sorry. 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 Have you drink water yet? Looking dry and crusty. This garden's back to normal, huh? Hi, Q pitch day. Nano de Soreo appears to the CM Gauch Taino this guy. Model or Darini Suruka de Comate must be. A promo featuring a Western princess in Japan clothes would sure earn you guys some bounty points. Sylvie was eager enough, so there was no room for me to say otherwise. We made some time for it. The photo shoot ended in no time. Hakuni stick must be. Hi. We were left alone. Japanese clothes look great on you too. <laughs> this garden was charming too. On a date for two, refined moments like these could be pretty romantic in their own right. Had that whole, ah, sure I'm dating a princess feel. <laughs> Are you? Why? いつでもオーラのことを感じているわ。オーラとチーカちゃんも大好きなのに。チーカちゃんもオーラが大好きなのね。これはこれで焼けるわね、彼女。オーラにとって私には絶対に。Uh, no way she's on a pedestal. I mean the freak. <laughs> now, now. The jealousy so we made a sudden appearance. I was in a position to laugh it off, which was quite a luxury in my opinion. Well, because you're dating a princess? That's probably exactly why. But yeah, maybe I am grateful I ran into him today. Not to him, but to God. Why? <laughs> Sylvie immediately picked up on the meaning of what I quietly whispered and smiled happily. <laughs> That's a whole lot of gas. Yes, so. I went without saying that this wasn't enough that absolved me of what happened that summer. It was a fact that everyone suffered misfortune due to my actions. But it took a bit of weight off me, maybe? <laughs> if you disregarded how everything turned out, what I had done wasn't wrong. Being able to believe that helped all on its own. Obviously, a positive inco income outcome would have been preferred, though. <laughs> Why'd you laugh like that? Don't do that anymore, please. I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> huh? So we smiled at me in a suggestive way. Oh, what kind of way are we speaking exactly? What was it? Something. Sylvia, sir. Oro, can. Arigatou gozaimashita. Mo kekko des. Hi. With that, our conversation was put on hold. Now that her job was over. Oh yeah, Kikuchiyo. I hear you're running a lunch fair right now. We got back to the main subject. Oh, hi. To. Desu ga restaurant ni Sylvia san ga kuru to sawagi ni narimasu ne. Oh, taberare nai no? Ie. We ended up borrowing her changing room. There had been an assistant present to help when she got dressed, but the room was now empty and she headed in alone. Well, a princess couldn't afford to expose her skin, after all. Wait, now that she was alone. Bone in time! Yeah! <laughs> I like that. Control yourself, me. Those clothes look expensive. You can't get them dirty with your nut. But Sylvie was a princess. Couldn't she work something out if it did get dirty? Kikuchiyo was the one who'd have to apologize too, for that matter. Like it or not, it was pretty sketchy to rely on the girl to pay. Like it or not. Like it or not. Yeah, 
She changed surprisingly quickly and came back out in no time. Rude, there's no way a gentleman like myself would ever do such a thing as peek. <laughs> Cap, we decided to head back. We don't have much time left either. Oh, I just remembered something. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. So I think on uh, Friday, Saturday, I don't know when, but a few days ago in my time. It's uh, the 20, the 19th for me, Monday. I made a poll on the community tab asking, do you guys like me alternating with the visual novels or if you'd rather me focus on one at a time? And it seems like most of you agreed that it's better I focus on one at a time, which is not a bad idea either because considering how long the visual novels are, it would make sense to try to grind one out of the way, you know, you know, knock it out, get it done and over with. But then if I'm jumping around, obviously it'll take a lot longer to finish one. <laughs> the thing though is that there's so many games coming out all the time and it sucks because I can't be here, there, and there, there, there. And now I do have a lot more time now. I recently started working. I asked for less hours. I started working eight hours, which is the regular work day in the America. I don't, I'm sure it, or maybe that's how it is all over the place. I don't know. But anyways, I started working less hours, started working eight hour shifts. And ever since then, I've been able to pump out more videos. I don't know if you noticed last week, I uploaded four videos, which is crazy. That's something that I haven't done in forever or if ever. So that's really great. That's really great. And uh, what was, where was I going with this? Jesus Christ, I don't even remember. Oh yeah, so people want me to focus on one at a time is what I'm getting at. But also what I wanted to say is that because I am focusing one at a time now. I'm definitely going to finish these visual novels a lot quicker, hopefully. Hopefully in like two to three months. And it sounds like a long time, I know. But you also have to consider how long these dang games are. Like, it's crazy. But yeah, that's it. That's all I wanted to say. <clears throat> we don't have much time left either. Quite some time had passed while we were eating the meal. Kikuchiyo's staff prepared for us. Given the time, the sun would soon be setting. Yeah. More cream pie in. Let's do it. But I can't show it. The security guard... Well, I can't let it be heard, I should say. Because I did censor really well, I would say. The biddies and all that good stuff. But YouTube still heard the audio and was like, Nah, 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 nah. We, we hear what's going on. Restriction. I'm like, No! And then TikTok, of course, was like, You do that again, we're going to take you down. So yeah, not messing with that again. The security guard would be coming around any time now. So we decided to call it good. So then, what now? Not that we had much time left. So that was her whole day. It sounds kind of bummy. Kind of mid. You're not cold? What does that mean? So she said. We headed back to our original location and rested for a while. Did she just change clothes out of nowhere? Hold up, I need to go back. What? What? Hold up. Hold up. She was just in her school uniform, wasn't she? How, how and what? What? Huh? Sylvie picked up her cell phone. The naggy papa makes an appearance, huh? <laughs> Sorry. The call was live? The unexpectedly high performance of the cell phone Sylvie used was a problem. Uh, that sucks. Hi. She ended the call. Hmm? Why? Why is it so loud? That reminds me, I didn't see her today. Even though it was always there at Sylvie's side. Oh, heck yeah. But what if someone like kidnapped you and we didn't have that little bird looking thing around? That would have been bad. How is she that fast? <laughs> 20,000 meters in the sky. What? This thing's performance knows no bounds. And. Uh, huh? What are you doing, Kyoto? 
Kira, what are you doing? Open its mouth wide. Oh, hear me out. Sorry, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. A chair and table flew out. Then even a tea set appeared. And finally, a huge tablecloth. <laughs> That thing does everything. The speed at which Sylvie got changed was even more impressive. Yeah. Yeah. We settled down for tea time. Man, though, it's cold. It was already the latter half of December. Although there was no wind, it was still extremely cold. Cold wind is the worst. Or maybe hot wind. No, cold wind. Wait. No, hot wind because during summer, you could literally get naked and it's still hot. When it's cold, you put on like five sweaters. I cannot speak. You put on five sweaters. Did I say that right? Anyways, and you'll be fine. <laughs> Yeah. If, but you're not. But if you were an ordinary girl, you wouldn't have been able to enroll at Noble Academy. So we giggled. I really am grateful that you changed my life. You saved me when I was at my most pathetic. I felt pretty relaxed after getting to talk to Torio and Chiaka. I was finally able to face the past I hated to even remember. She had told me I hadn't made the wrong choice. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Tomorrow? Why? I'm so confused. Did she just roast us? Him, I mean? Not us. Hey, you two. What are you doing out here? Huh? It's too early. You're leaving already? Wow. That's a surprise. I was always under the impression Maria Bishop wasn't involved in any of that stuff and was showing up last minute to sing. I caught a glimpse of the spite from a woman who knew the media's inner workings. I'll never, never not hate Ayaka. I wonder if we're gonna get more of her in the next roots. I kind of hope not. At the same time, I kind of do. I want to know a little more about this little douche here. I had heard that she was her coordinator, but I was surprised by how deeply involved she was in the process. It was sad that the lady of the hour wasn't enthusiastic in the slightest. Ria and Jogasaki hidden in the venue first. Hey. It starts at 5. Should be plenty. We head over around 4 o'clock. We do have plenty of time to kill. Oh no, get away! <laughs> same, 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 same. Although the date had started on that note. Yeah, around the time night fell. Jesus Christ, it's so weird to see her in uniform. She's always in the track outfit. Well, lucky hasn't started accumulating yet. 
so far seemed to be sporadic. Even so, it was really cold. Yeah, I love snow. <sighs> Warm. Thanks. She walked on with that walked on it, welcome, wrecked them, walked them us, welcomed us inside. All of the Novel Academy students have been invited to today's party, and around half or so were currently in attendance. <laughs> Why is he here? Why? <clears throat> A similar party had just been held in this place the other day, but the atmosphere today was totally different. The usual air of maturity and stiffness at those these sorts of events was nowhere to be found, and it felt more like a gigantic class reunion. This was Noble Academy, however, so there were tons of students dressed in high class attire. Yo, yeah. Huh? Oh, were they some Showa-era comedy duo? I wish I could see how they look like right now, but I doubt we'll get that privilege. Chick. Mitsurin-de-san-san-yen-kurai-de-kaisou. Why'd you revert to your nasty rich kid personas all of a sudden? I mean, I'm not sure if you're a good person. 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 I see. Oh, yeah, Hey, ヒクチョウも制服なんだ。え、動きやすいですからね。それなりのドレスコードとも思いましたが、学園の皆で集まるならこちらの方が清掃かと思いまして。ねえ。ですブロニーリラックスドゥ。イサンズロー <laughs> Sobi, why are you in your uniform? Yeah。それって Good idea. I felt a little bad for them. Why don't you get changed too? Huh? Huh? ふざけるな。俺は貴族だぞ。貴族らしくこの場を乗り切ってみせる。どうやって一末お前の服10万で売ってくれ。なあ、わけ。貴族ってかなり金だね。あらくん。おう、ゆいゆい。本当に入っち
父さんたちは呼んだんだけど来なかった学生の集まりって聞いて遠慮したんだろうねであと大事なお兄ちゃんはもう来てるからなら残るは棟梁君かなってあらヒヒヒヒ、What the heck, precious? I've got such an adorable little sister. Why don't I give you some pocket money? Man, all of these people still be invited with total n u a n c e Nuisances? Shut up, r a y n a But something lovely. Oh, that. Yup. Yup. Mina, Kyo, I saw a shee naka. Kite k r e t a r i g a t おいしいものいっぱい用意したから楽しんでいってね。So we quickly concluded her speech and stepped down from the stage. As she entered the room, the buffet style dinner had convened, and the greeting from the guest of honor was true. えー、続きまして、皆様今日を彩るとびっきりのゲストをご紹介させていただきます。Called up by the black suited guard acting as master of ceremonies. She made her appearance. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> In a rare turn, Jogasaki was on our side. Yeah, don't spill it. <laughs> it might get out eventually due to a certain someone. <laughs> so we walked toward a nearby piano. Next, Maria stood on the stage without so much as a single greeting. And then, naturally. The way everyone listened quietly was what made one worthy of the title, Diva. It was a beautiful song. Someone with piss poor music grades like me couldn't possibly evaluate anything to do with pitch or octave, nor even understand them, but it was beautiful. That was all. I know we're gonna get the Sylvia or the Maria Bishop featuring freaking Sylvie. That's crazy. That was all. Your song was elevated with the support of Sylvie's performance on the piano, which was said to be one of the foremost in the world. It, of course, left an Outstanding impact on all of the students as well. For someone who played music like Chieka, it was sure to be a good experience. It was something lovely without question. Ria, I never stopped being a Maria Bishop fan, even after discovering her true identity. And. Hmm. Her gaze turned this way for an instant. She was looking right at me. Was she singing this at me? Couldn't be. I was obviously being overly self conscious. But I was happy. When the song was over, Maria quietly got down from the stage. So we stood up as well, and they both gave the other a bow. The venue was silent, almost as if everyone had forgotten how to applaud. The students were simply spellbound by the comfortable reverberation that lingered in their earlobes. What dispelled the hypnosis we were under was. Huh? <laughs> Clap. Mm hmm. Ah. Oh, it was gentle, but they high fived. Not the best of etiquette, to be sure. Everyone was so startled that the magic instantly faded. You all heard the club. I was sure one of the performers would say a few words, but there's no way that was happening given my real personality and the risk of her identity being revealed. So she took her in. <sighs> yeah, huh? <laughs> I see. So this performance was directed at me. I saw it in the world. Yet, I'm not 
Can we get rid of her, please? Please look at her. Look at her. There was a wide array of reactions. As for me, I was a little bashful. As much of a happy occurrence as it was. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Did they? いつまつどのの発案と聞きましたよ。彼女は歌がお上手だからいつか一緒にと。はあ？え、それもシルビー様から伺っております。オーロッタら自分が言ったのに覚えていないのよと。あ、I'm that's to be expected. We're talking about a decade ago. Well, um, there was nothing that definite. Even though they had made weddings. Huh? Was there someone like that? So That's enough meddling in my past. And then Hey. You got changed? Eh, Shigotawa I saw her like this all the time when I visited the roof, but it was apparently rare for anyone else. You changed too, huh? Achinokakojasawaginaru. You got changed, huh? I wanted to see you dressed that way a little longer. Melancholic. Real life still held majorly destructive force against me. She wasted absolutely no time picking up the habit. It would obviously be off if they let her smoke in her uniform. <laughs> Chieko took a step forward. さあ。ありがとう。あの、あの。私もう一度音楽始めてみます。うん。ああ。もう一度ルックや Beside her, our childhood friend's eyes started water. I was glad, thanks to this, I could hold back the feelings that welled up inside of me. I would make for a pathetic brother if I cried with others watching. The feeling of that deep pain that once pierced my heart being lifted was enough to move me to tears. And then... Hmm? escorted three girls toward us. Chick and Torio both went wide-eyed, as did I. Chick's friends. Hawamoto Ruriko dono, Mashirogi Kanae dono, Miyama Saori dono. The three of them seemed very nervous. I mean, yeah, they were ordinary girls. I bet they would be terrified after being called to a foreign country's consulate out of nowhere. What? What if she had never said that? You can't just pull up her friends like that. That's a little weird. The three nodded, seeming to have been told this in advance. And... Chiaka was startled by the news. <laughs> Don't ask me. This is news to me, too. 
You didn't. But if I really gave it some thought, the way Sylvie seemed to know about the band, even though I hadn't told her, did feel out of place. Heck, I only knew Ruko, Mashira, Senpai, and Yama. But those nicknames, but Sylvie knew their full names. I assumed she must have been planning this for quite some time. Mm, that's a little sus. <laughs> the other two band members aside, even Miyama-san, the vocalist who had dropped out of the band had come to the party. She seemed a bit uncomfortable, which made me assume there was still some bad blood there. But... あのシルビア王女が直々に家に来て頼むんだよ。音楽の世界じゃ神様みたいな人がシルビーってそんなにすごい？年齢から見たピアノ界の功績では世界でも十種に入りますわ。大したもんだ。You're a god in the world of vocalists yourself, though.また一緒にやってくれるの？あ、ま、ま。勝手に飛び出して私も悪かったと思ってるし新しいとこと並行どかできなくはないしそっかありがとうミヤマさあメイクですこちらへはいフォー girls followed after Ellison <笑> Sovi you really did it huh this was a bigger surprise than I could have imagined. That was quite a high hurdle for me to jump over, but I was happy and immensely grateful to her. The biggest thorn in my heart had been removed. Shut up, Ayaka. Nobody asked you. <laughs> uh, every minute, every chance, every, every, every whatever. I'm going to flame her. Agreed. I could have said as much as the person she had made happiest. Sylvia Le Cruz Canon, my girlfriend, was the kind of girl who'd brought everyone around her happiness. <laughs> Sylvia flashed me her usual brilliant smile. Her expression made the rest of us smile in kind. Sylvia was surrounded by smiles the same as ever. No. ところで終わろう。シェイカちゃん大丈夫かな。うん。あ、ならいうメンチね。乗ったん。おう、シーズリディキュリスリーネルヴィス。そう、私は思うと思うんですけど、それは本当に素晴らしいです。そして、彼女
What? What? Hopefully this isn't copyright music. Oh. What? I was not expecting it to end like this. Usually I'm pretty good at feeling when it's coming to an end and I didn't think it would be now I'm a little sad man Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Are we going to get a little extra like in the previous? Nice. Good. Good, 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 good. I'm glad they didn't leave us on that little cliffhanger. The performance was over. And so we came back. Good job up there. I brought along drinks. レベル高かったな。あいつらこれからどうすんの皆様、ご観覧中とは思いますが、ここで言った席の配置を変更させていただきます。続いてダンスタイムの準備となります。ご協力をお願いします。あ、ダンスだって。学生主体のパーティーに必要かとも思いましたが、学園には社交ダンス
Although I said recently, it had been only two weeks since I decided to aim to be a diplomat. It had been a while since the last session due to winter break, so I was glad I hadn't gotten rusty. It wouldn't have made for much of a surprise if I had. I honestly should have done something to further my goal of becoming a diplomat for my expert planning classes, but I really needed to step up my dancing game if I was going to be paired up with a princess. I should have cooled during the times that called for it most. Good call, buddy. Nothing wrong with doing it in your uniform, is there? But look great on her anyway. You don't need to think about it that hard. Yeah. Hey, Sylvie. I still got a long way to go to be your partner. I'm definitely not suited for the role at all. It's okay. That's how I feel. But that's exactly why I work hard. I'll never run away again. I'd been generally pathetic during that incident over summer break. Facts. Chieka's band and the baseball club. I still wish I could make all of it right again. To turn away and run from it all had been pathetic. Things would be different going forward. And I would keep on acting like my coolest self. This is my golden time. When I need to push forward most, I will. I believe that's what that time was meant for. So please, stay here by my side, just like you are now. Since I wouldn't run away. <laughs> Alright. Shut up, Ayaka. あ、ありがとうね。いや。ずっとこの光景を夢見てたから小さい頃出会った男の子とお姫様は大きくなったら再会してそしていつまでも幸せに暮らしましたとさ。それで俺は最後にこういう目で立ち目で立ち。Nice
and i'm not sure if that's when they all stay as friends or i'm not sure i'm not sure i don't remember it that sounds more like the common room i might have misunderstood if correct me if i'm wrong but i do believe i had seen something about an actual end like the true end and i want to believe personally that this is the true end because of how much they seem to have emphasized Sylvie being the main love interest for the protagonist but man I, I really love this route i love this route i thought it was really good and i really love sylvia's character she's wholesome i love her she's great with that being said i have nothing else more to say about this route other than the fact that the end made my eyes like a little sweaty i felt it and i felt my voice wanting to break a little too because it was just such a beautiful ending i loved how they wrapped it up that was really good i thought it was great I thought it was really great. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this too. And I hope you guys are enjoying the series as well. We still got four more heroines. We got Reyna, which I'm really looking forward to because she's such an idiot. But I love, and she's literally an idiot, but she's funny. She's really funny. We got Reyna, we got Ellie, we got Maria, or Rhea, and we got Akane. The ones I'm not looking forward to are Rhea and Akane because I want to look at Rhea as the, the homie. And then Akane is just like the, you know, like the homie. That's it. And then Ellie is like, she's like the mom of the group like uh, like for some people it's like oh milf great awesome cool but like the thing about ella is that i feel like without sylvia it feels like there's no ella you know what i mean and i don't like that personally but i could be proven wrong with a root i don't know i am keeping my mind open for that but reina's i know for a fact i'm gonna love her sir <laughs> and i'm really looking forward to it and i hope you guys are as well but i'm done talking i'm gonna wrap it up here i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and i hope you enjoyed this route as well as much as i did i really really did i really love this route if you did please drop that link for me subscribe if you haven't already done so and you made it this far let's get to a thousand subscribers please i know we could do it come on guys please let's do it a thousand subs we're so close but so far away and with that being said i'll let y'all go y'all stay safe and as always until next time fellas